It's me again. Our lesson for today is about properties of addition. There are three properties of addition. The commutative property, the associative property, and identity property. The first property is commutative property. It means that changing the order of the atom does not change the sum. For example, 3 plus 5 equals 8. And 5 plus 3 equals 8. What do you notice with the addends and the sum? The order of the addend has changed. 3 and 5 and 5 and 3. But the sum is still the same. This property is called commutative property. The second property is associative property. It means that changing the grouping of the addends does not change the sum. For example, 4 plus 7 plus 2, we can get the sum by grouping the addends into two ways. First is 4 plus 7 plus 2. Group 4 plus 7 4 plus 7 equals 11. Copy the 2. Eleven plus two equals thirteen. Second, four plus seven plus two. Group. 7 plus 2 Copy the 4 7 plus 2 equals 9 4 plus 9 equals 13 The example shows that changing the grouping of the addends does not affect the sum. The third property of addition is identity property. It means that any number added to zero, the sum is always the number added. For example, Oh.
100. Plus zero equals 100. When zero is added to a number, the sum is the number itself. Thank you po for watching. Until next time, bye!